My name's John and you're fishing with Paul B, baby. <laughs> what is going on, guys? Another day fishing with Paul B. Oh, man, is this coronavirus driving you guys crazy like it is me? I am heading to, this is an actual secret location. I can't really share with you guys. You know me, I won't be careful. You can look in the background. If you can tell where I am, come on and fish here. But I gotta get down to the river. I was talking to somebody today. They said they were out fishing yesterday. The runoff is crazy. The flood levels are up. The river's high. It's milky, it's chocolatey. But I gotta get out, go nuts in my house. So we didn't get nothing last time. Day two, coronavirus <laughs> isolation fishing. Let's see what happens. Let's see what today holds. Let's go fishing. <laughs> I'm gonna bust out my carrot stick with my Shimano. We're gonna try casting some bigger spoons out there, see if anybody's in the current. Uh, as I work my way down river, there is a narrow deep spot. It's always a good trough. Always have good luck catching browns, bulls, rainbows, whitefish, pike, <laughs> on and on and on. Anyway, let's get this rod set up. Let's go fishing. <laughs> Just to reiterate guys, I'm not getting paid for this. Apparently I say that now on YouTube. I tell you guys what I'm using because everyone asks me. Every video I make, people ask me. So I figure, tell you guys what I'm using. I'm not getting paid to do that. Now, number two, I don't know if these guys are friendly. What do we do? I want to get down to the water. Fence looks electric. What fence do I jump? There's no real gates over there. <laughs> I may need new shoes after this, but hey, no horsies. Looks like we can get down over there. Another fence. And for the record, yes, guys. Oh, nuts. Uh, if you know where I'm at, I do have permission to be here. This is one place. Don't just go sneaking in. Oh, I don't want to fall. Some deer track down here. There are still wild places in the city, guys. You just gotta go look for them. Oh, that's not good. Well, looks like I can get down over there. The only reason I'm not fishing right there, be irresponsible. If I caught a fish, I'd have to yard him up by his face to get the hook out. It's not about hurting these guys. They are my buddies. Still can't get down. Oh, there's our spot. Are you guys going crazy with this coronavirus? You feel stuck? You feel trapped? I do, and I'm getting out. I know people that are stuck at home, got no job. All right, well, looks about as good as any. Let's go on our little ledge down there and do some fishing. <laughs> this is some really fast flowing water here. It's worth a try. They're looking for us. <laughs> Spot one's a bust. Ended on a big spoon. The current is really fast. Uh, did lots of long drifts. I don't think this is a good spot. I mean, I know there's probably fish here, but I really can't move down the bank. I got trees in each direction, so I'm gonna try a different spot, see if we can get down to the river on the other side of those horses. Let's see. <sighs> to get out of my house, man. Oh, to be on this river. I feel blessed with all the craziness going on. To be in a beautiful location like this, I feel blessed. Let's get out of here, look for a different spot. I wanna catch a fish in today's video. <laughs> Oh, fishing with Paul B, baby. <laughs> Looks like a nice little back eddy over there. I don't know if I can get there. This path I'm on puts me dangerously close to the electric fence. We'll follow this deer trail. Let's see where it goes, I guess. Right now we're pretty high up off the water. It's probably about 15 or 20 feet down, but having an adventure. And it wouldn't be any fun if it wasn't an adventure. And I do not want to touch that fence. I just got a bad feeling. All right, let's just do it. Let's get this over with, see if it is electric. Who knows? Nothing there. Oh. <laughs> he took off pretty quick. We'll see if we can get him again. He's just up ahead of us. Unless I lost him. We got a little coyote working the riverbank. Same as us, probably just looking for food. Although I'm not looking for food. Well, let's go see if we can get attacked by a coyote. I don't know if that'd be good footage, getting attacked by a coyote, but sure would get views and likes. <laughs> Where'd you go? Buddy, it's actually quite a few coyote tracks. Oh, there's that sheet of ice with that little back eddy. I wonder if I can get down there. I can see what I walked up here to find. I just got a feeling I'm way off the water again. Ow! 
Well, that's what I want to fish. Don't know if I can get back up once I get down. We'll go to that tree there. Let's try that. Perhaps another blooper reel on its way. Put my rod somewhere a little safer. All right, guys, let's see if there's an overhanging tree. Oh, hold us. Hold us. Hold me. I guess hold us. All right. <laughs> we made it. We're down at the river. All right, let's work this little back, Eddie. Change that up for a spinner. I'll get back to you guys if I catch anything. Let's get this fish. It ain't a fish. Oh, did I get my lure back? Oh, I did. Ha <laughs> ha. Oh, I kept my lure. Oh, sweet. I don't know if that's fish or I could feel it hitting the rocks. Well, that definitely was a fish. Well, spot one is a bust. Well, that was spot one over there. There's spot two. This nice little back eddy here, what it looked like from downriver. It isn't really a back eddy, it's just a smooth spot on the surface because of this hunk of ice. Oh, I've tried everything. I'm gonna try last ditch effort. Got a big white spoon on there with a Colorado blade. I don't know if that's gonna work, but we'll try it out and then we'll get out of here. See if we can't climb back up that tree we came down. Otherwise, I'll be calling for help. <laughs> okay, we'll go back to the truck, get a GoPro battery, unless I catch a fish in the next three or four casts. See you there. <laughs> All right, it didn't look that high when I let myself down. And now I gotta try to get back up. And I do, as you guys know, have a bum knee. So let's get a rod up there though. So if you guys are ever on the river and you see my rod just sitting there, and well, I guess you wouldn't know because this video won't get posted. I was stuck on the riverbank until the river got high enough to wash me away. Oh, uh, hope not. <laughs> let's get up this tree. <laughs> I legitimately can't get back up. There's this little guy. I dug into the side, wedged myself into the thorn bush and try and climb up here. Oh, I'm, I'm stuck on the riverbank. Oh man. That's better than being inside. Well, let's see if we can climb this. I got no way to mount the camera, so we'll just see how I'll let you know if I get up there. Oh, okay, we may have made it. I'm not out of the woods yet. <laughs> oh, okay. Oh, well, didn't that just suck more than it needed to? <laughs> oh, okay. That's what I just climbed up. Oh. Let's go get my fishing rod. That sucked. I pooped. Oh, all right. I think we go back to the truck. Up river just. Looks like a big ice shelf and I don't want nothing to do with that. Oh, I was actually stuck. I'm not joking. I was wondering what I would do. Oh, there you go. There's a safety tip for you guys. We all know it. I didn't practice it. Let people know where you're going. If I hadn't come back, at least someone would have been looking for me. I had no cell reception. I was stuck, but we got out. And I want to say even a week ago, I wouldn't have been able to get out of there. My knee improves every day. It was a big effort to get out today, but uh, guys, let people know where you're going. <laughs> Let's get back to the truck, try a different spot in the river. <laughs> hey guys, how are you doing? Hello. Okay, we call this spot number 2.5. Three, three point five. I don't know. The river is nice and slow here. Got a nice little back eddy over there, kind of by the construction. See if we can't catch a fish. Oh yeah, this spot looks a lot more promising. Looky, looky, looky. Fast over there, nice and slow here. Hmm. I think we're gonna go up here, fish all this slack water. Oh yeah, baby. Oh, I got a good feeling about this spot. I got it, I got it. The Bow River Stickfish. <laughs> well, this whole stretch of the river 
it was a bust. But I still got loads of time in the day, a couple of hours. Let's go try a totally different spot. I tried every color, every shape, every size. I tried huge spoons, little spoons, spinners, divers, Rapalus, Len Thompson's maps. I tried uh, Deadly Dicks. I tried, I just tried everything. I tried every color. I tried chartreuse, I tried pink, I tried silver, orange, uh, black, nothing. So let's go try another spot. That's all, that's all I could say. Man, two videos in a row so far. What's going on? <sighs> I'm always talking about my go-to spot. It's where I caught that big white fish. I heard it's hard to get down there because of construction right now, but hey, <laughs> we'll find a way. Let's head there. I'm tired of this no catch of fish. Anyway, I've got to uh, unlock this gate and get out of here. The uh, farrier was working on the horses. He said he'd leave the gate open for me so I could let myself out. I just gotta lock it when I'm done. Let's go lock the gate. Make sure we lock the gate. And that's that. driving over this bridge I saw what looked like a deep hole it is on the elbow river I can honestly say since I moved here I haven't fished the elbow so let's give it a try hmm. how to get down there man this is a nice spot this is good for fly fishing in here Oh, I have no luck here either. There's some fly fishermen that are up for me. The one guy said he's been there all day, nothing. The other guy said he caught one early this morning, but hasn't seen anything since. I think I see a lure. Let's go get it. Maybe it'll be our lucky lure. It's not really a lure. Huh. Well, let's see if we catch a fish. This would be lucky. I'm on the try. Well, I don't know if it's a lucky lure. Because <laughs> I, a lucky charm, because first cast, uh, we're hung up. <laughs> we gotta go down river, see if we can't get that thing loose. There it is. Hey! Alright, try that again. And this spot's a bust too. Alright, no more dicking around. Let's try to get to my spot. I haven't been able to get there lately because they've been under construction. <sighs> Where are the fish? <sighs> that rock right there. That rock looks like somewhere a fish would hide. I gotta try it. I gotta try it. Uh, I know where I should fish. Here. Huh? Jeez. Probably better luck in that puddle that I'm having in the river today. Because <sighs> I can't swear on YouTube. We're gonna say, let's go to the crap house. If you know where that is, that's where I'm gonna go try fishing. If I can get there. Well, the rumors are true. Uh, Light handed to me since Kelowna. I've never fished Lake Okanagan and not caught fish. And that was the start. The last trip down to the river, nothing. All day today, nothing. Man, what is going on? Let's see if we can find a way down to the river from here. I don't know. I just don't know anymore. <laughs> We're here. We are here. Year 2021. So, so no fish in here until no 2021. Yes. Oh man, okay. All right, I'll try and get to the other side of the river. Oh, well, you guys heard it. No fishing under the calf rope bridge until 2021. <sighs> I thought I'd cheat and sneak down there. Oopsie doop. But nope, nope, got busted. Security was waiting for me. Ha! All right, he said we can get down to the river on the other side. I've never been there. Let's Google map it. We'll see. <laughs> Get to the river here. Oh, what a day! No fish, running out of daylight. Still a good day, you know. 
Well, there's a parking lot down here. I'm not sure what that means, but I've actually never been down here. Maybe it'll be a good spot. Can't be any worse than All right, promising? I don't know. Just ran into another fisherman. He said he was here. He had nothing. He did say there's a couple nice big deep holes down there, but that's been my day today. Just one after another. Nice fishing spot. Nothing to prove. Hey, man. Well, he got skunked. Let's go see if we could break his bad luck. <laughs> it's beautiful here, though. Still got maybe two and a half hours till sunset. We're going to start off with the classic. This isn't my favorite blue fox spinner. I like a yellow blade. These were on sale. Maybe that's my problem today. I'm not using what I know works. Maybe it's the carrot stick. Maybe it's the 2500 FG syncopate. Maybe it's the fish god. I don't know. Everyone I've run into today said no luck. Nobody had any luck. Maybe I should have went with you, John, down to Pine Cooley. You told me you guys are slaying them down there. Let's see what we can do. Mm, river bridge. River bridge. River bridge. Ooh. Train bridge. Hmm. Let's go straight. We'll go straight. And then we can look both ways down the river. Oh, you know that's nice. I'm actually getting a bit of a sunburn. I can feel it. Ah, skin feels tight, crispy. <laughs> I've had this green glow from doing nothing but watching TV under house lights. So it's just nice to get out. And you know what? It's coronavirus. As screwy as it is, from a fishing point of view, it's not so bad. All the spots I've gone to that are normally crowded, nobody here. Anyway, talk, talk, talk. That's all I'm doing today. Let's catch a fish. <laughs> I say, let's go out where this creek bleeds into the river. I've always found that creeks in the rivers tend to be better luck than no luck. And today we've had no luck, so better luck would be good. Ah, okay, we'll take that little muddy creek. It's usually got bugs and stuff getting washed down it, washed out into the river. Off-road trekking. All right. A boggy little marsh down here. Well guys, down there, under that bridge, that's my go-to spot. It's under construction. This bank, outside bank, some deep holes, right, right there, under construction. The video where I went on the train tracks, came down that hill right there. I was fishing this corner. That's where I got chased out of. Of course, this side, it's the shallow side. As far as I can cast, I'm hitting bottom as soon as it hits the water. Oh well, let's see what we could do. Let's get down by this train bridge. If it sucks down here, we'll head up to the highway bridge, see what's there. I just saw something. Look at the rocks. One, two, three, four. Let's head over there. Let's see if we can fish those piles. Might have some better luck. A little forced back eddies there. We'll see. We'll see. And nice little bridge. Maybe another blooper reel. Never know. <sighs> well, there's a path right behind me. <laughs> but it's fenced, so we've got to walk the riverbank to get down to the spots we want to go. I think WCB should have physio walking on uneven rocks for people's knees. Oh, man, this is tough. If I get to the end of this and there's no fence, I'll be... <laughs> I won't be pissed, I'll be happy. It'll be easy to get back to the truck. <sighs> this is a nice hole here. Let's give it a try. <sighs> we'll try here, but that's what I'm interested in is here. We might as well do them both. Or not. See the bottom in there? Super shallow. Come over here. We'll just try right along that current out into this hole. Can't not catch any more fish than we already have. <laughs> All right, from those rocks into that nice hole there, nothing. <sighs> we'll try it from this way, coming downstream. Then we'll try this one too. I am just running out of energy. I only got so much gas in the knee tank. I hate when big rocks wobble. Just saw fish rise right there, literally. 
All right, what to do? <laughs> oh my God. Oh. Guys, it fell out of my pocket right there. I had to go shoulder deep. Reaching in, just barely got it. Oh, I thought I lost my camera. I thought I lost my camera and all the footage. Oh, oh, what a good day. Oh. <laughs> it's crazy how it goes from mad that I didn't catch any fish to just super happy I got my camera back. <laughs> I thought it just landed. Bloop. Calmly got down on all fours, reached in, moved a rock. Two big holes left and right on top of a pointy rock. As far down as I can reach, I can't touch nothing on the left. As far down as I can reach back here, nothing. I come in. I notice there's a hole going that way. I get right up till my sleeve's getting wet. I feel the camera, but I think it's a rock. I go to move the rock to see if I can reach any further, and I realize, hey, it's the camera. Oh, that water's cold. Woo! <gasps> All right, guys, <laughs> I'm running out of daylight. I've been out here all day. Almost lost my camera, so going for the Hail Mary. This big Len Thompson I found at the Bull River. So let's give it a try. We'll go for four or five, ten more casts. Well, guys, all day, nothing. We do have this beautiful sunset, though. I see fish rising. I had a wonderful day on the river, but sure would have been nice to catch a fish. Even lose a fish would have been nice. But didn't lose my camera. Didn't get hurt. Managed to get back all my lures that were snagged. So, all in all, a pretty good day, really. It's been an odd day, though. Spinners down at the river. Last year was the go-to. This is my second trip to the river. Spinners, spoons, lip divers. Nothing's been really doing it. The other thing, too, I don't know if it has to do with the season or what, but, man, there's just a lot of this white, slimy algae. It looks like it's toilet paper. There's a lot of it. Come on, fish. Oh, it'd be so nice to get one at the end of the day. Just to validate all the time I spent down here. I don't feel like that's going to happen, though. Uh, one last attempt, I guess. I'll go for a float with a couple flies hanging below it. It's about the last thing I can think to try. So we'll go gaudy style. See what happens. Well, it's a beautiful sunset. I haven't caught nothing i think it's time to go home before we get pooped on huh? oh you've been fishing with paul b baby fishing is the key word wow apparently every sea dog in the world has somewhere to be right now all right well anyway oh yeah i don't know what's going on there's a big herring flying by we got seagulls flying by we got geese flying by and there's a ton more coming oh i hope that's nothing ominous hey eh? why are they all flying south all of a sudden well, let's see if there's an earthquake. Hmm. Anyway, beautiful sunset behind me. Tons of birds in the air above me. Potentially looming coronavirus infection to all of us. Looming earthquakes, looming volcanoes. But we're outside. And that's all that matters. Get out. Find somebody you hate. Learn to like them. Find somebody you like. Learn to love them. Take somebody who's never been fishing. Fishing. Make a friend. Make the world a better place. One fishing rod at a time. Paul B. signing out, baby. Ah. Everybody, wiggle a bit. You know you want. Keep that